hey you guys welcome back to shasha's world in today's video you guys sorry about the noise i'm gonna tell y'all just watch the video to make candles candles from the dollar store um i'm gonna show you how to do that um i showed you how to do things like if you have like inventory and stuff and if you don't you can always prep from the dollar store so stay tuned so today y'all i'm in my kitchen um i know y'all heard something boiling i actually have the candles in here boiling because i'm melting um, it's hot y'all but i'm melting the wax so I can show y'all how to do it from scratch. So I'm melting the wax. As y'all can see, it has a lot to go. But I'm melting the wax. I have three of them in the pot. And this is going to be, y'all, sorry if y'all hear some noise. My dryer is on. I'm about to stop it. Let me see where it's at. But um, I want to show y'all everything I got. So this is a trick-or-treat bucket. This is basically for my um, Halloween um, inventory, which I'm going to show y'all because I'm going to take this everywhere i go it's not gonna be a lot i'm gonna just get enough to where i want to sell i'm gonna take it like to work and you know stuff like that so i can see if people come on to buy it so i'm gonna do that so this is gonna be the inventory bucket for halloween so this is my halloween candle and wax milk thing okay i'm gonna move this this is usually what i put my stuff in um, so from the dollar store I got this right here it has a pumpkin on it we're not using this and it has a string I really got it for the jar so I can you know use the jar I'm gonna take this off because I have my own warning signs that I actually purchased so we're gonna revamp this whole thing I just wanted y'all to see it for yourself so I got that one from the dollar store I got this one also the same thing the pumpkin head um and the screen and it also has the thingy majiggy and i got two of these i got one in my makeup room but i'm only using one because i got requested to do like one pacific candle like this she probably don't even want this full size but yeah she don't want it to be it but after she see it honey she gonna want it um i have faith in my inventory y'all i have faith in my candles i'm telling y'all the smell is what is what draws people in of course i'm gonna take this off and put my own one and signs again you want the candle to look like your own so you just revamp the whole thing yourself so this is the clear ones also from the dollar so all this stuff is from the dollar store y'all i'm thirsty drink your water this is the best water y'all um, i'm gonna show y'all that again so these I actually purchased myself. I have a whole bin of these because I knew I was going to make some candles. So I bought a whole bunch of these. So I have a lot of these in inventory. So I'm going to use these in the inside because as you can see, it don't come with like the candle thing in the inside. So I'm going to show y'all the things that I'm going to, you know, kind of do, which y'all will see once I stop talking. But these are window decorations. So I'm actually going to stick these. I hope y'all can see them. I'm going to stick these in the front of the candle so it can look like a Halloween candle. Revamping again, like I said, revamping myself. And for the clear candle, I'm thinking about that being like a fall scent. So I'm going to put like fall flowers on it. So I got two of these. Um, I only got one of these because I'm not going to have too many Halloween candles because I know a lot of people are not going down. So, I honestly just got this pack, and once I run out of this, this should be it for Halloween. I'm not really trying to, you know, get into, like, too many, because I know a lot of people are not going to buy them. But I got two of these, because I can always use these for next year or whatever. So, I can always use these. So, I got two of those. So, I'm going to show y'all what I do. So, I'm going to take this string off. This is what you do if you don't want to buy from the internet, because... This stuff we had y'all and especially when you have like a lot of stuff coming in and um take this off 
I took two of them off already. You can actually save these as well and do something with them. So I'm gonna save them. But um, yeah, you just take the rope off, and I'm gonna clean the glass with. Ooh, I'm gonna clean the glass with alcohol. This is what it looks like now. Very hollow greenish, right? It bought it out when I took that off. And I have my alcohol. I'm going to just wipe it off with the alcohol. So, let me show y'all the hot. But this is what it looks like now. Don't try this at home. I should have on a glove, but I don't. But it's as y'all can see, it's melting now. So, what I'm going to do is take... I'm going to take alcohol in these pads um, and just wipe around the glasses. I'm going to show y'all and then I'm going to come back once I finish. Once I finish all of them, you just take your glass and you just wipe it with the alcohol. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. My um, candles are still boiling. Um, they're halfway finished, so I'm going to have to hurry up this process. But now we are about to put these um, thingies inside the candles, and we're going to use the sticky things. I usually use hot glue gun, but these are easier. So I'm going to use these. So you just, damn. So you just stick the candle piece on here, like so. And then you take the bottom off, the sticky off, and put it in the middle of the jar. So you stick it in the middle of the jar. You just pin, do it like an eye. I do mine how I think it is. That's about in the middle. These thingies, they're like popsicle sticks. That's what people call them. So you put that in the middle, and when you pour your candle in here, it will, you know, sit this up for you. So that's how you do it, guys. Very easy. And these things right here, I ordered these offline because it has the punch hole right here. But honestly, you can get these popsicle sticks. That's what they are. You get them from the dollar store. You can, damn. You can get these from the dollar store. You can punch a hole in it yourself if you want to save money. But again, these are not very expensive. So that's why I buy these offline. Because sometimes I don't have time to put a hole in it, punch a hole in it. So I don't. So I'm going to show y'all one more time. And then I'm going to speed this video up. Take it and you put it where you think the middle is. About right there. And you make sure it's in there. And bam, it's in there. You stick this on it. And this will just hold it up for you. And that's it. That's your candle. So I'm going to do this. Oh, I did want to show y'all before I speed this video up. We're going to use lemon flavor for this because this was requested lemon flavor. And I'm going to show you guys how I stick these on the cameras as well. Y'all going to see all that. So just stay tuned to the video because I'm tired of talking. Y'all just look very closely. I love y'all and I will see y'all in my next video. Tell me how y'all like these videos. Tell me how y'all like these videos. And I'll continue to do them because I'm giving you the option to save or you can buy inventory. Y'all seen in my last video, y'all seen mostly all the inventory that I did have, like the jars and stuff. I still get those jars, but sometimes you want to save money, y'all, because this is not a big business yet. Not just yet, but it's going to be. So, yeah, y'all just stay tuned and just buy a candle, buy wax mix, melt, support my business. I love you guys, and I will see y'all in the next clip.